through. Right. I I think we're live. Oh, I think maybe we're live. I'm hoping we're live. Hey guys out there, we're having some potential technical difficulties. Yeah, we are live, end, definitely though. But it feels like we're live, so we're gonna treat. I'm seeing us on live. YouTube, and to oh, me, that's live. That's pretty live uh, to me. All right, cool, cool. Uh, so chat for us if you say hello, Greg. Thank you very much. Yes, Can you apples to apples tonight. No, oh, yeah, 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 not quite. We'll play <laughs> like apples to apples though. <laughs> All right, Greg's checking us out on Facebook. Thank you, Greg, yeah, and uh, he's saying we're coming through. So uh, the uh, yeah. the simulcast is underway. <clears throat> so we will get going. Hello, which this is which game first? The board game podcast Monday night live, yeah. coming to you. And thank you so much for tuning in. I am Evan. I'm joined by Mikey. You know it. And Ed. Hi guys. Celeste Hello. sends her love. She was here last week. Couldn't be here this week. I wasn't here last week. I can be here this week. So we're <laughs> trying to cover for each other we're as flipping, best as possible, flopping. doing it's what fine. we need to do mm -hmm. to uh, to get the games to you, as we want to do every Monday night, 8 o'clock on the East Coast of the United States. And this is a good time to remind you that if you're not already uh, subscribed to us, you can go ahead and subscribe to uh, Which Game First if you're watching us on YouTube. And the like button and the thumbs up and watch our videos and give us the good reviews and give us the chit chat that we like to see or give us the criticism. We'll take the constructive criticism, definitely will, but we don't do the trolling. We won't suffer any any trolls or fools or foolish trolls. <laughs> but other than that, please tell us. Uh, we want to hear from you. We want to hear all about the gaming that you've been doing. Just We'll, we'll come up with, we'll, we'll talk with you about any conversation you want. Board game related, absolutely. So... Thank you so much for helping us out. Promote us on the social medias. Share us, like us, all your friends, all your family. We are family friendly. We are rated PG by, and that's even a stretch. It's probably closer <laughs> on the G side of the PG. Yeah, we're pretty realm G. of things. Five. So, <laughs> so just wanted to send that those reminders out there before we get down to business tonight, which is of course uh, the game, and the game is called Draft Cider. Mm. Draft Cider. Which, which we are playing at uh, Board Game Arena. Mm -hmm. And I closed the window that had my uh, board up. Okay, there we are. Good. Um, so I am going to, I guess, explain how the game is played. Then we're going to play, and there is some trivia tonight. So we'll get we'll go fit in some trivia. Uh, it's it's listed as a quick game, a fast, a short game in on Board Game Arena, which for us means under an hour. But for Board Game Arena, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's usually like uh, 15 minutes uh, or less, but we'll see. We'll see how it goes. You know, these things uh, can mm -hmm. can vary. But again, the game is called Draft Cider. And the idea here is that we are going to be choosing uh, cards from an available uh, display of cards. And we're going to be placing them each on our own tableau. And uh, Mike has one. I have one. Ed has one. Mm -hmm. We're going to be filling each of ours in. We're going to be doing this for four rounds. And when we're taking apples, and the idea here is we want to make the most productive, which means yielding the most victory points, the most productive ciders from the types of apples that we choose. Every apple has three traits to it. It has a color, which is obvious, as you can see there. Uh, they have height, a height rating, and they have a sweetness rating. And those will be the parameters by which we're allowed to place the apples that we choose into the various orchards, and each of us have eight orchards that we can play these cards into. Mm -hmm. And it plays like some other games you may be familiar with. The one I found it to be most familiar with is a game called uh, Draftosaurus, which we reviewed probably about a year or two ago uh, at this point, in which you're in that game, you take dinosaurs in a, in a theme park and you put them in the correct pen to earn victory points. Mm -hmm. We're kind of doing the same thing here. We're taking the apples, off the apple trees, putting them in our orchards in certain combinations to yield victory points. There are eight sections. We've got the monochrome batch, where we're going to be trying to match like colored apples, and that will yield victory points. The next one is called uh, apples of a feather, in which we're going to choose a specific trait, either uh, height or sweetness, and we're going to be stacking up a bunch of apples there and trying to match those exactly. Same height, same sweetness. We've got the special color one, and that one says you get 20 points if this is the only card of this color in play on your board, excluding a place called the Bad Batch. So uh, 20 points if you can meet that special color section. Oh. Then there's the Unlucky Batch. 
Unlucky Batch is where you want to have a sweetness rating of exactly 13. Got to get 13 and you will score points. 12 won't do it and 14 won't do it. No horseshoes and hand grenades here. So it has to be 13 and that's why it's called the Unlucky Batch. The mm -hmm. fifth spot is called the, uh, what is it called? Fort Piano Height? Uh, Forte Piano. Forte height. Piano Height. I should have looked that up probably, that mm -hmm. word before I uh, played the game. Hello, Jack. How are you doing? Hope everything's well tonight. Uh, scoring height differences times two. So what you have to have on that one, what does the rule say for that particular one? Number five uh, points are the difference in height between each pair. So And the heights may not be the same. So you can have... You have to have different heights and two sets so of them. Four and a one is two different, so it'll be times two, which is four points. Right, that sounds right. Uh, the sixth section is sixth section is called sweet couple, and you get pairs. So you're looking for pairs. Uh, now pairs by definition, can they go by any? Are they pairs by color? Uh, the Imagine pairs are pair. sweetness. Seven points for each two of the same sweetness. So you're looking for the sweetness factor there, and okay. pairing those up. And I think the maximum you can get there is 42 points. Uh, yes, 42. maximum 42. So remember that, so guys. You don't want to just, just be concentrating on that one so area. Six pairs, you'll max basically. out. Seven, uh, six, six pairs, correct. Yep, that's mm -hmm. right. The seventh section is called Steady Height, uh, in which the, the cards in order, let's see, I believe that has to do with the height rating, obviously, and it would have that's to be like weird. one. Only You can only vary uh, one number at a time, so it would be like... Three, two, one, then two, three, four, right? So you go like one one at a time hmm. in varying heights. Uh, the heights must be within one of the previous card each time, correct? So that's how you're going to so score your points there. So scoring, it says scoring is prime numbers per card within one of previous card. Uh, that's, how, that's how that gets scored, right? So, so one and then three and then five and then seven and then uh, 11. Yeah, yeah, I haven't, and again, each of these sections have their own scoring mm -hmm. methodology, which I'm not going to explain here because you're not going to remember anyways. We'll probably talk about mm -hmm. it a little bit maybe as the game goes on or towards the end of the game, mm -hmm. how the scoring is going to work. But yeah, there's crazy kind of calculation for scoring for each of these eight sections. Yeah. Um, and the last section is called Bad Batch. It's kind of, bleh, you throw your garbage there. Minus one point for each uh, apple tree planted there. Oh. And... Uh, Oh, that doesn't mean? mean one point per card minus one total? It just says here in the rules, minus one point for each tree planted here. Oh. So that's okay. it. It's just... A, oh, it's you a... lose points, period. You don't get any points. Yeah, you, you just get minuses. Minus tossing. one, minus one, minus one for oh, each one. Oh, that's horrible. Okay, good to know. All right. And there's All a right. tiebreaker. In the event of a tie, the player with the most cards in different batches wins. So that's that, that wants you to they want you to spread out they don't want you mm -hmm. lumping up so much in just one or two or three areas if you have four or five you're spread out a little more it'll help in your tiebreaker so if it comes to that drafty this guys is drafty, is that, right? uh well, yeah yes because i think we're each going to take two cards because it's a three player game and i believe okay. that's how that's going to work do we do All one right. at a time it's one card yeah so one card and, and I go first, so it's, it asked me to draft a card. Mm -hmm. So I guess I'm going to go first and fourth okay. on the first round. Yep, is what I think is going to happen. So Not do really. We exactly all see sure these that. cards right now at the top. Uh, I see six cards: uh, three green apples, two gold apples, and one red apple. Yep, is that I whatever? think we all yeah, see the same. Right. Yep. So okay. these are the community cards. We are all playing off the same pile, and there'll be four of these, four rounds. Mm -hmm. So there's going to be 24 cards in total. Not a lot. So this game's going to go pretty. Pretty quickly. I'm gonna choose my apple first, place it, and then I'll let you know what the trivia categories are once I have a chance to do that. I'm not gonna have much time to really study these rules so much. So let's see. Uh, the red apple we'll has some nice rounds. features. Oh, six rounds? Is that what's gonna be six rounds? Yeah, that's six. what it says. One of six. It's a total of 36 cards. Right. So each of us are gonna get 12 cards total. So okay. remember that. We're only gonna be placing 12 cards tonight. Uh, good luck, everyone. Uh, let's have. Let's have. How about? Well, as long as I can go, it has to be the same. Yes, yeah, sweetness. Yeah. I'm trying to think, because yeah, you gotta. You want to. Uh, what kind of strategy do you come with? I mean, it's first? too early to really have a solid it, strategy. It kind of is. Fill in categories that are easier to switch. Stuff yeah, into, maybe. I mean? 
My hey, strategy to like, see what your strategy is first. <laughs> right. So say, there's my strategy. I just do threw not one into start, this. Yeah, I say do not start with special color. That's a terrible strategy. Uh, good. I didn't do that. Thanks, Mike. Yes, no problem. Whew, thank goodness. It's Ed's turn, but I am going to read the trivia categories if that's all right. Ed, if you don't mind, right, take care of these real quick. We've, we've got, and it's the usual, my usual pattern is uh, four categories, five questions per category. We do a Jeopardy style. Uh, for those of you just tuning in for the first time, but for those of you familiar, that is how I do it. And the four categories are draft, cider, mm -hmm. apples, and the last category is called sayings. Sayings. Oh, sayings, yeah, which is not so much a grab bag trivia, you know, random sort of thing. It's, uh, they, these are sayings. I'm going to, mm -hmm. I'm going to read something and you have to tell me what the colloquialism Okay. is based on That's what fun. i say that sounds really fun yeah that'll be a good one <laughs> i'm looking forward to that one All right, thank Ed you greg and uh, thank you jack both for putting the uh category names in there where are I you guys encourage boys? everyone because i oh, uh, i to see there. chat if you're there watching us let me know you're there just say hi you don't have to play the trivia games if you don't want to so don't feel bad about that i haven't played a gold <laughs> apple on a sweet couple Let's, let's, now let's take a look at Ed's board and see what he did. Forte Ooh. piano on height one. Yeah, oh, sure. Sense. The most confusing of the categories, of course, he's here. going for that. He took one for the sweet Oops. couple. I'll, I I'll did. This one here to there. All right. Wish All right. Luck. Now, obviously, I'm going to make my, my pair right now. So that's a good thing. Nice. And we are gonna let's let's get the trivia rolling. Oh, uh, it doesn't Greg. go back and forth. That's terrible. All right. <laughs> uh, all right. So let's do this one. I'll let um, Greg start okay. with the uh, trivia whenever you're ready, Greg. I'll get it going. Whoa! I didn't know there was a five sweetness out there and a five Sweet. height. Sweet. Wow. And Mike goes first, which makes sense. All right. It so I will go with. Oh, Greg wants one. sayings for four hundred. I'll, I'll do it after Mike does his turn because he wants to hear these. Oh, yes, I definitely. Um, what is going on? I'll here? wait for Mike. My board. I pick this one and I put it there. Why won't it go there? Why won't we it go there? We are making ciders from apples. Why will it not go there? Uh, okay. Square numbers. Let me look at Mikey's board. I'm trying, oh, to move. The... I'm trying to put something else in the unlucky batch, but it won't let me. Is there any uh, restrictions to what I can put there? Hey. Your total sweetness adds up to 13. Let's mm -hmm. have a look at the quick rules there for that section. See if there's any restrictions. Okay. Unlucky batch. Sweetness must add to 13. Okay. But the sweetness cards must be within one of each other. <gasps> oh, no. <laughs> That's <laughs> way different than just getting that? the 13. <laughs> <laughs> wow well this Which, is within one though yeah i mean it, yeah you know one's gonna be you're gonna have an odd number card and an even number card so is it you should be able to do a sweetness three or a sweetness five I'm right do a sweetness five and it won't go in there um hmm. oh. yeah it won't let me do it you chose oh, the card Kobe's right? turn that's why no, oh well duh <laughs> Ed's oh, Ed's going to swipe the five from me right there. Okay, cool, 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 cool. All right, let's 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 get to the trivia. Sayings for 400. I don't know if I can get it with this. Put some of your organic vessels in multiple carrying devices. I can't. Uh, oh, ha, ha. I think I can. <laughs> uh... I can't do it. Why? What? Come on. Uh, I need. OK, so I'll play something else. That's good. I'll play a this one. Hello, Ochre Get. I see your answer there. I'll play that one here. Oh, did it work? Oh. Yeah, it worked. It's just I unplayed the other card on. I, I didn't realize I was not playing the other card. I can't see what card you played. I thought oh, it was the, the height five card on top of the height one height card. Height five on top of one. Yep. Forte yep. piano. Yeah, there you go. Oh. Uh, hmm. How did I play? Mm -hmm. Mikey took the lead. Get him. Uh, 
I'm trying to switch. I'm, I'm switching boards. Let me look at my board. Right, I got my pair. Now I'm board. looking at yeah, Ed's sweet board. Couple. Sweet couple. Huh. Am I not able to see? I only it's see like, your first two cards. I don't know why I can't see the third card you guys played. Well, me, it's I interesting. Only, uh, Are you able to see Ed's three cards on his? I only played board? three. I played three because they're stacked. Look and stacked. see if you That's see. Why. Oh, is that why it? Yeah. Click to view cards behind. That's why. Come yeah, on. they're kind of camouflaged in the back there. They are camouflaged. You can camouflaged. click on it to view the card behind. This is a weird game, guys. This it's is a little weird. weird. All right. All right, well, I'm going to concentrate on my own. And anyone who answered putting all your eggs in eggs one in basket, basket. Yeah, yeah, yeah. or don't put your eggs in one, all your eggs in one basket is correct. And yeah, yeah. someone thought it was apples, but no, it's a... <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah don't it. put all your eggs in one basket, yeah. <laughs> Uh, speaking of which, I gotta put some apples into my orchard. Which one, though? Which one? Okay. Let's see what this is. This is the only in play on your bar screen badge. Don't Let's pick that, that one, Evan. Is. I'm choosing this one and going here, confirming it. That's it. I'm going for Perfection. it now. Perfection. Going for it right now. I love my that. board. Greg says, getting to the core of this game, I see, uh, as an yes. apple core. Very good. Here come the apple puns. Yeah, oh, yeah. Very good. Very good. Uh, so, Okraget, you get to choose next next trivia. Yes, but let me plant a little seed, Okraget. <laughs> the sayings category. <laughs> oh, looks like I get the last card. So... Yes, I could do this one and go here. I'll do that. Mm. Okraget would like sayings for 200. Mikey, it's your turn, first of all. Uh, a hog in a sack. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad I'm making Mike laugh. I love it. <laughs> Thank you for choosing the best category, everybody. <laughs> well, I got my first set. <laughs> oh, it's my turn. Yes, of course it is. All right. So I don't want that. I want this. Play numbers within one. The previous. Right. And so I, I could do that. Special color and anymore. put it there. And confirm it. Done. Okraget says, what is a pig in a blanket? In a blanket. Uh, that's not quite correct. You got pig part of that poke. right? Pig in a poke? <laughs> it's pig in a poke. That's the saying. Pig in a poke. That was good, though. Pig in a blanket. I like that. I think that should count. I think that counts. All right. Well, Mike says it counts. So, Okraget, you get to choose <laughs> the next category. Uh, let's see. Did I also mention we're going to be at PAX Unplugged this year? Oh, yeah. Mm. December 2nd through 4th, Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. And if you're there, oh my gosh, we so want to see you there. I guess in the Midwest, a poke is, is like a Midwest term for bag or, a, you know, an old timey kind of 1920s <laughs> <laughs> slang. Oh, I have to play a card. Um, let's see. I've got these apples here, golden apples. I want to go height and sweetness, huh? Mm -hmm. Guess it would be. Let's do that one. All right. What's that score? Seven five. Oak would like draft for two hundred on trivia. Draft. He was the 199th pick by the New England Patriots in the 2000 National Football League draft. Wow, the 199th pick? Sheesh. By the New England Patriots. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> Isn't <Wow>. that crazy? <laughs> <laughs> that's impressive. Oh, my gosh. Jack Burton, Tom Brady, yes, absolutely. Yeah, Tom Brady, yeah. Yes. I was going to say, you're like, right too. it has to be shocking, right? So it has to be like the best player you can think of. Okay, I can't match either of those. I can match that one. I can do that one. Where's, come on, give me a height. Give me, oh, none of these match. Crack. Crank. 
I can't uh, match anything. That my my apples of a feather is a total waste right now. That's not good. Um. All right. Let's do the whole height thing. I guess. Um. Height. Let's see if that one works. Okay. Try that. Oh, what did you pick? Okay. Yeah. Or Rodney Dangerfield. <laughs> <laughs> That's good, Jay. Uh, Jack, you get the board. Hmm. Hmm. Let's see what Ed picks. Apples for 600, says Jack. Apples for six. All right. Apples are the second most valuable fruit grown in the United States. What's the first one? Value. What's number one? Apples are number two. That means like total U.S. dollars sold per year or something. Yeah. Hmm. Like wow. Grown in the United States. And it has to be a fruit. Greg's asking, have a favorite plant-based game, y'all? Ah, oh. uh, plant-based game, huh? Huh. Um. Uh, question. That is a good question. I'll have to ponder that for a bit. Greg says oranges. Okraget says oranges. Jack says oranges. All correct. Nice. It is oranges. I think we've got the, like... I almost guess perfect climates for yes. oranges in the world. Yeah. And that's why we're uh Yeah, we can grow them year round. Almost, yeah. Right? Florida, so, California. Yep. We've got them. Oh, interesting. Oh, it's gonna pass on choosing, so we're gonna give it to Jack. Jack will take the board when he gets a moment. And I am gonna try to figure out what the heck to do here. Uh let's see what my heights here are. I've got a height three, height really? Is that what that is? Okay. Uh, can't do those. Can't do those. Evan has 33. Evan has 34. Oh, man. How you guys so far ahead of me? I'm not sure. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I'm curious. Like, I mean, this is two sets of eight. All right, we'll do that. And then this one's 13. All right, Jack wants cider 29. for 400. I should have 29 points, right? Uh, we'll come back to that. I'll double check you in a second. But cider for 400, a novel by John Irving. Turned into a movie in 1995. Hmm. Let me take a look at Mike's board. I have to try to figure out what his score is. Yeah, I got 13 for Unlucky Batch, right? Uh, I, four, four, I'm five. Oh, yeah, there are three cards here. You got yep. four... Five and four. You're good for th unlucky. Height five, height one. Your heights height are five, height one. So that's you know should be what? Oh, actually, how's six. how's that one scored again? I forget uh, how this. Two. That should be twenty four points right there. Oh no, sorry, it should be twelve points right there. Okraget says, "What is cider house rules?" And that is correct. That's three. That's six. That's twelve and thirteen. Oh yeah, that's correct. Okay. All right, well, I guess I'll pick this one here. And I'll put it over here. <laughs> apple poc apple cop <laughs> apocalypse apple apocalypse apple That's what Jack. Apocalypse. <laughs> I like that. Oh gosh, if we run out of apples, that would be the thing. Um <laughs> Definitely. All right, Greg, I'm going to let you choose. We're we'll spread it around a bit. We'll share the love. Share the trivia love. Let me see what you guys are doing. See how many got how many got that many points. Got apples of a feather is nothing. Monochrome batch is what? Triangle numbers in order. Played one three, so that should be one. Special color. Oh, so you still got the twenty from special color. That's yeah, why. yeah. Hope so I can maintain that. So you that. can't play any more of the red apples. Okay, that's right. Good to know. Good to know. I'll try to leave. But ignore that. Apples. Ignore that fact. And please. what does Ed need? What is uh, special? <laughs> apples for 200. Finish this phrase. All right. So I'll take green apples. Got it. <laughs> Finish this phrase. Do you like apples? <laughs> 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 I know that one. <laughs> uh, let's see here. <laughs> Wait a minute. Oh, that's not my board. That's why. <laughs> that was confusing. Uh, four.
There we go. Sweetness. I guess I could do the sweetness one, right? <laughs> Jack, how do you like them apples? That's right. Yeah, I like them that apples. Is the, Thank that you. That is the correct answer got to that. that. That's good. <laughs> good job, Jack. Control the board. <laughs> if you like apples. I know what Ed's going to take. Oh, let's have a look at his board and see. And then I know what I'm going to take. Sorry, Evan. Don't even... Don't. You can't... You can't Apologize <laughs> before you do it, and it's then inevitable. do unless, it and mean it. Unless Ed, you can't himself. really say you're sorry if you're deliberately going to do <laughs> no, it. You understand Ed, what I'm saying? Listen, unless Ed screws himself, you're screwed. <laughs> no, <I'm> just come <laughs> on. <laughs> That's all I'm saying. I, I mean, I could be wrong. I could be. I could be say sorry to Ed because he screwed himself. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just questioning the sincerity for which you really feel the sorry, because if you really felt it, I don't, you I, would I, make I, a I, choice I, I in which you would you not mean. put me in a position, put me in a position to feel sorrow, sorrow, sorrow. <laughs> right? Sorry, sorrow, sorrow, see how that hey, works. Sarah, Sarah. Now back to more important things. Yeah, Jack wants the same. On Lucky Batch, you need to add up to 13 points, but when you play a card, it can't be more than one number away from the one of the last cards you played. So I played a five four four for sweetness. Right. So you could take that red apple height four sweetness two, or you could take that red apple. Yeah, you're going two. by sweetness on that one. Yeah. So it's, it's not if you do two, you have to do okay. two, three, four, which would be four by seven, eight, nine. Two, three, four, five would work. I uh, yeah, well, you're right, Jack. It wasn't a sincere sorry. It was a formality sorry. It was, yeah, it was more. I mean, listen, it's I wasn't actually feeling sorrowful for you, so it mm -hmm. wasn't that kind of sorry. And that was what I was basically mm -hmm. questioning. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, don't question <laughs> it. No, I was not feeling sorry for you. <laughs> it was more like saying, like, wah, now, wah, now it is wah, time. Wah. Now you can prove yourself. All right, so Evan, the world. what is your single color? Red? Okay. I'll <laughs> apple, and I'll put it. <laughs> Mike, you can prove you're a bigger man than the game uh -huh. right now at so, times like this. You can You can elevate yourself higher. You can ascend. And you can become more than just the sum of a game. This match. Let's go to, uh, By this action alone. This will define you for the rest of your life. Let me just say that. This action you take next. All right, there and we you go. Chose, you chose. I chose wisely. You chose. <laughs> you chose. Evan, let me give you some advice. You though. chose. Let me give you some advice. Yeah, Evan, okay. Adv advice the... from, uh, from Mike who feels I, sorry. I, I, as everybody who's sorry. ever watched this show knows, I do give good advice. I don't try to mislead with my advice. You don't have to screw your 20 points. You can just give yourself a minus one point by throwing. Now, will that count, bat. though? I mean, it, or no, is that the still bad playing? does not count. Yeah. That just does, yeah. You just lose one point instead of losing twenty points for your special color. So now, right. from now until the end of time, Evan, you have to uh, throw away all red apples you end up with, or you're going to lose twenty points. Well, if you would take the red apples, I wouldn't have to make that choice. Yeah, but who now, wants would those? I, Mike? Um, oh wait, what do I have here? Uh, Jack's three. been very patient with this trivia, guys. Please this allow me. Three. Sayings for eight hundred. A very sweet way to say a task is easy. A sweet way to say a task is easy. Hmm. A very sweet way to say, to say a task, task is, is easy. easy. Oh. Uh, All right, let's see. Uh, Back to my honey, maybe? master plan or... here. Hmm. Sugar, honey. Uh. Hmm. <laughs> I don't know that one. Ah, I'm drawing a blank on that one. We've got a bunch of easy as pie. Yes, Ooh, I would have also accepted. Pie. I would have also accepted piece of cake. Okay, all right. As well, so there were multiple correct answers there, but easy as pie definitely, uh, definitely do does work. Height? Wait a minute, do I have a? Height? And yes, Oak, it is hard to do trivia and height, work height, height, at the one, same time, one. which is why I lose most height, of these height, games. Yeah. Um, but that's okay because it's not about me. Mm -hmm. It's about right. you. I want to win so badly. Um, 
All right. Height. Yeah, I tossed my special color right away, which is probably a mistake. I'm still still doing good, but Ed's at 48 now. Sweetness 5. Is this the last round? This is it, right? This is the last card. These last two cards? Oh, no. (laughs) Oh, man. I should have put that anywhere but where I put it. Where can I put this and not get hurt? Darn it, I thought we had another round. It's six of six. Oh, well, I lost. This is going to be it. Congratulations, Mikey G. You lost. Evan, screw Ed. I can't put it there. What, by taking the red apple? Yeah, take the red apple. (laughs) 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 Take the red apple and toss it. (laughs) And then Ed will be forced to toss Uh, it. Yeah, but I can't win anyways. No, it's over. Yeah, it's pretty much over. Ed won. So let's just do that. Let's just throw it somewhere and call it done. All right, but apples for 400. They want the last uh, trivia here. Okay. Um, let's see. Oh, this was their rec- uh, This was their recording label. Uh, uh, their recording label was Apple Records. That's- I hate that xylophone music that plays at Board Game Arena when you are in third place. I, I really... It's a sad trombone. Yeah, it's the freaking Price is Right wah wah music. I, I don't wow. like it. It's like in your face. Well, I didn't come and in yes, last, Jack, only the because I punked Evan. Yes, the Beatles, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you got your minus one in on me, Mikey. Yeah. I did, I did, and it didn't help. <laughs> I guess Actually, it didn't hurt that bad either. No, it was minus one point. It's not that big of a deal. Honestly, yeah, next time I play this, I'll I'll try for a special color. I Again, just, we've, we've played other games like this, guys. Um, yeah, the other one we played, the special, like, the special, like, only, only here dinosaur space ended up being not worth it so that's why i skipped it on this one too yeah because it cuts your options down but just losing one point for having a toss one is not a big deal to protect no not too bad i seem to remember in draftosaurus there were more severe negatives when you started yeah, throwing yeah, yeah. your dinosaurs in the river or whatever with the, <laughs> yeah whatever it was like minus was. two yeah. and then you lose your thing anyway i was like no no bueno and anyone so, who get did guess beetles was correct the beetles all right nice well, uh, that's draft cider. We did it. We did it, guys. We did it. Oh. And, it and, and because of the season, it is fall. It, and, and you know, sense. we're here in the northeast part of the United States, which is a beautiful place to be in the fall. And certainly apples everywhere. You get apple and, you know. Apple cider ap- apple donuts. Everything. That's what you get. Yeah. Apple cider uh, donuts are pink awesome. Pink lady apples. A- apple, apple cider pies, donuts. Oh. So good. Apple turnovers, just the apples picked right from the tree. They are delightful. So it if, was def- if you're making a pie this year, those might I suggest using Pink Ladies and then Granny Smith's mm-hmm. and Fuji's. Use those three. Yum. Yum. Now Greg Fuji's. says this, guys. This game looks horrific. Scariest Halloween I've seen. Ooh, um, <laughs> yeah. Speaking of Halloween, uh-huh. folks, one week from tonight uh is October 31st. It is Halloween. So um, we're going to not be playing next week, all right? And we will we'll put out a, a, an announcement on our social media. Also, as a reminder, wishing everyone a happy Halloween. Um, we're going to skip the night because it's just going to be a little too crazy. We're each going to be dealing with our kind of own thing going on. I know my mm-hmm. doorbell is going to be ringing off the hook and stuff. we got a lot of kids in our neighborhood. Yeah. And uh, I want to go trick-or-treating, too. So, uh, no, I'm kidding. But <laughs> so we think it's best for everyone that we're just going to miss next week, but we'll be back the following Monday, the first Monday in November, mm-hmm. and uh, for another game. And who knows? Celeste, maybe all four of us might, might be there maybe. Uh, for that particular one. Let's hope so. But until then, we are Which Game First, a board game podcast live Monday nights, mm-hmm. 8 o'clock. Thank you so much for spending your time with us tonight. We Thanks, do appreciate everybody. it. See you at the show and see you in two weeks back here. Laters. Yep. <laughs> hey, I kind of want an apple now. I know, right? Mm. I, have, I think I have a bag of apples. <laughs> nice here. apple crunch. You like the uh, what's the what's the one you always get? Uh, Honeycrisps. Honeycrisps. Honeycrisps are yeah, good. Yeah. Yes. Those are really.